Hey guys, so today's video is going to be a tutorial for this eye look using the Sonia Kashuk Ion Neutrals palette, which I've been really liking. This has actually been a go-to look on the weekends. I've worn it a few times already. Sometimes I do with the glitter because I do have like glitter liner on. Um, sometimes I do without. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Super quick and easy. Really good palette. I definitely recommend it if you've been thinking about it. So yeah, just keep on watching. Okay, so I'm just going to start off by priming my lid with the Essence I Heart Stage eyeshadow base and this is like my favorite I use this thing every day just I like the way it kind of like neutralizes my lid um, but I have noticed though that it's like getting hotter if I don't put like an eyeshadow over it or something it will crease so that kind of sucks but if, as long as you like put eyeshadow like over it or whatever it doesn't crease so I just I really like it because it like neutralizes my lid and I'm going to be using the Sonia Kashuk Ion Neutrals palette, which I've been loving. And I'm going to start off with this kind of pinky, like tannish color. And I'm going to put that all over my lid and then kind of like take it into the crease. And I'm just using like a regular like flat shader brush. And then I'm going to take a little bit of this like off-white color and just put a little bit of it in my inner corner just to kind of brighten that up. And then I'm going to take a blending brush and I'm going to take more of that pink color and just run it through my crease. And kind of blend it up too because it will make it easier when we add the darker color to like blend it out. And now I'm going to take a mixture, oh, I can't even see, I'm going to take a mixture of these two colors but more of this like kind of tannish one um, and put that as my highlight. And now I'm going to go ahead and run this kind of like reddish brown color through the crease but just kind of keeping it on the outside. I'm going to pick up some of that pink lid color and now I'm just going to put on my gel cream liner. I'm using the Lorac um, gel cream liner with just an eyeliner brush. I actually use two now. I've gotten into this mode. You know how you like change your techniques and the way you do things all the time? But I like to use the Sigma E05 for like, you know, my actual eyeliner. But then I like this little L'Oreal brush. It comes when you buy um one of the one of the L'Oreal gel cream liners. You get this little brush with them, and I actually save them just randomly. But I really like them. Like the shape makes it really easy to do like the wing out. So that's what I use this for. But yeah, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do that. Now I'm just going to let this kind of set for a little bit or give it like a minute to set. But after that I'm going to be applying, this is a NYX, what are these called, liquid crystal liners. And this is called Crystal Silk which is just like gold glitter. So once this sets I'm just going to go over it with the glitter. So now I'm just going to go ahead and let that dry up and then I'm going to curl my lashes and apply mascara. I don't know if you guys know this but I use first Maybelline um, and then the e.l.f. one and then my Ulta one for my lashes. So I'm going to go ahead and let this dry up and then I'm going to do that. So once I've done like the rest of my face, that's when I go back in and I do like my lower lash line. And I'm just going to take the reddish color that we used in the crease with like an angled brush and just run it 
not halfway in, but kind of like all the way halfway, but just faded so it's not too, too dark. And then I kind of have it go like outside of the wing and then I blend it. And then I'm just going to apply mascara to my lower lash line and I'm using a brown mascara. I tried using black the other day and I just didn't like it. Like I like the way brown mascara looks on my lower lash line so I'm going to use brown. And I like this one because it doesn't flake on my lower lash line which is the reason why I always use this one. And then you guys always ask me about this. This is a lash card. I have a packet somewhere of new ones but I can't find it so I just stick to this one. Um, but you just, it's made for like your lower lash line and then the other side's for your, like your upper lashes so you like don't get mascara all over your skin because I'm like bad about that but yeah you can get them at lashcard.com. So that's pretty much it for my eyes on my lips just to kind of tell you guys how I balanced all that. I'm wearing the L'Oreal lipstick and this is in Forever Frap which is just like a really nice like everyday color and then to give it more of like a peachy look I used Revlon Revlon's Killer Watt Electrocent Lip Gloss which I've really been liking. So I hope you guys enjoyed the look. It's a little darker and a little more dramatic than what I normally do but I really like it. I will list all the products and everything that I used in the description box for you guys. Questions let me know and I'll talk to you guys later.